Attention, lady people. Has anyone ever told you, your body is shameful and you should be embarrassed to be alive? You are making people sin with your femininity. Stop it. Can I borrow some money? Hide your body. It's making God sad. If so, those people are wrong and ignorant. That's not what Jewish modesty is all about. Take it from me. I'm a man. Since the ancient beginnings of our people, Jewish men and women have valued modesty. And indeed, it is commanded to all of us through the prophet Micha. And walk modestly with your God. But what does modesty really mean? And why is it so important? Contrary to popular, erroneous belief, modesty is not for the sake of others. Take this straw man, for example. Why should women have to cover themselves just because men have sinful thoughts? Men should just control themselves. Silly straw man, your perspective is flawed. Behold, all things have externality and internality. The externality of the human is the body, and the internality is the soul. The body and the soul are in constant battle over the core identity of the human. Every time you choose to indulge in selfish cravings, you implicitly identify as your animal body. For example, I want another cookie. I just adore crack cocaine. I am tired. No, you're not tired. Your body is tired. If you choose, however, to be of service to God, your main identity becomes your true internal one, the soul. It is then that the body becomes merely a conduit for soul expression in the physical world. Understand this well, for it is the purpose of your existence. So now you ask, what is modesty? Modesty is the concealment of the external in order to preserve the integrity of the internal. This applies to our thoughts, speech, behavior, and physical presentation. A person's body is far from shameful. It is divine. But only when it acts as a vessel to express the spiritual entity that dwells within. Because of the great beauty of the feminine form, the average woman is inherently challenged with the temptation to find her value in her looks instead of her vast spiritual powers. An overexposure of the body inevitably leads to the misidentifying of this self as nothing more than a pretty and intelligent animal. This YouTube video is not intended to shame you or convince you to change your lifestyle. I only hope to provide you with a new perspective on our people's ancient traditions and wisdom. So take care of your body, even cultivate its beauty. But take greater care not to let that body blind you and others from what you really are. Crack cocaine is a highly addictive and dangerous drug which should not be consumed by anyone at any time.